morning. So I will put in the charts. Yes, sir. Yes, we will collect at the last. So today, any guesses what system we will be discussing? Any idea? Pardon? Yes. We have completed cardiovascular system. We have completed respiratory system. So shall we start gastrointestinal system or expiratory system? Okay, eyes closed. All eyes closed. Who want gastrointestinal? Eyes closed, please. Eyes closed. Eyes closed. Okay, gastrointestinal system, please raise your hands. Okay, hands down. Expiratory system, raise your hands. Okay, hands down. Okay, why were why were uh, okay? Open your eyes. Why were your eyes closed? Yes. Heart behavior. So that is called heart behavior. Why did you have mark? He is wearing mark. Why did you come to school? Because he is coming to school. So heart behavior. So majority of you preferred today. Yes. Yes. Okay, please believe this is the master system of the entire system. Because all are laborers of our body. Example, our lungs, it filters air, it gives you oxygen, um, it saturates the blood with oxygen. Cardiovascular system, it pumps the blood to the various parts of the body. And uh, excretory system, kidney, uh, it excretes what all the unnecessary salts, everything. But this is the only one system which converts food into Put into energy. 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 So let us divide our gastrointestinal system. So Shall we name the parts of the gastrointestinal system? Oral cavity, tongue, ula, epiglottis. Important landmarks. Then anteriorly we have trachea. The windpipe is placed anteriorly, the food pipe is placed posteriorly. That is why when you get a heartburn, uh, especially or you find very difficult to differentiate between gastritis and heart attack because <coughs> Heart and the esophagus are very closely related. Heart is anteriorly placed and esophagus is posteriorly placed. So any problem with the esophagus or any problem with the heart can mimic each other. <coughs> that is why majority of the heart attacks they think by the gas and the instrumentation. There is a longing for them. Annamari Nare Kare will get to Kingla. Yes. So, majority of the times, this is uh, missed for a heart attack. All heart attack is missed for a gas, uh, gastritis. We will come later. Then we have the 15 centimeter long esophagus. 15 centimeter almost. Aradi. Huh? Aradi. Yes. So, almost a 15 centimeter long esophagus. And uh, then you have the, this is the main mixing. What is this? Stomach. stomach. In the stomach, superiorly you have the fundus and then inferiorly you have the pylorus. Pylorus. Why this? Uh, and uh, this is called upper esophageal sphincter, lower esophageal sphincter, fundus, 
ரேங்கம் பைலோரஸ் அண்ட் பைலோரஸ் ஓபன் சிம்பு தி பியோ டினம் வெரி இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் பார்ட் பிகாஸ் திஸ் இஸ் தி பார்ட் ஆஃப் தி ஸ்மால் இன்டஸ்டைன் விச் ரிசீவ் தி ஃப்ரெஷ்லி ப்ரிப்பேர்ட் கைன் and then duodenum opens into jejunum jejunum opens into ileum from stomach to duodenum you have a differentiation called the pylorus but from duodenum jejunum ileum they don't have sphincters in between no walls in between whereas ileum opens into the large intestine at the place called cecum at the place called cecum at the place called cecum that is called ileo cecal junction and this is the place where appendix is placed and then depending upon the as the, the large intestine starts here from the cecum depending upon the position it is called as ascending colon transverse colon descending colon sigmoid colon rectum and I'm gonna okay Yes. So then, 
the food is swallowed, the quantity, the size of the food is manipulated by the tongue and the ula. The purpose of ula and tongue, mama is the mission, you are the answer, you are the answer, you are the answer. Okay, last time, what do you do? You can tell me about the tongue and tell me about the tongue. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Very good. 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 So the purpose of the blade is to renovate the income of the food. So however anxious you are, however very pathapad 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 you don't want to say that you don't want to say that this eula and the tongue will regulate the volume of the food and the tongue and eula act as a spatula of the grinder. So it rotates the food. So the summoning is the thing that you have to do, you use your tongue. Then what happens to the esophagus? What is the purpose of esophagus? So the esophagus is tunneling out of the food into the stomach. Tirpani kyaarla perithi ngay? Okay. And the unti ki maala oru periya ring kati irpaga. Apran the ring ena pannu vanga chinna rati irpaga. Riya, ena pooru ngayala pilsa pooru ngayala pooru ngayala pooru ngayala pooru ngayala pooru ngayala pooru ngayala maala oru periya rinko keela oru chinna ring irpaga. Gaun chingira? So, in that way, the esophagus is small to prevent the food that is getting digested from the stomach to come up. But in spite of that, several people complain of the acid reflex. What is that called? Excellent. Clap for them. Who is that? Gastroesophagal reflex disease. It is called GER. GER. So gastroesophageal reflex disease, we will discuss about that later. First we will discuss about some physiology of digestion. Then it comes into the stomach. So the food, as, as long as it is in this oral cavity, it is a violent reaction. Why the border of it is not? Unga control. Tirupadi uti marila. Potatinga na, koil control. Potatinga na, medical money madhul ma? Medical money madhul ma? Medical money madhul ma? But still, certain people ask it to stop there. In a manu anga? Mandir Panga, that is a psychiatry disorder, we discuss about that later. Okay, so until here it is voluntary. From here it is involuntary. It comes under the control of Vagus. Vagus is which cranial now? Tenth cranial? No. So Vagus is the 10th cranial now, your entire digestive system comes under the control of and once it enters into the stomach, it becomes a violent reaction and you know lot of enzymes, lot of enzymes, folic, hydrochloric acid and it takes around 2 to 3 hours for the entire food. That is why you should not eat as soon as you eat again. If you eat it, you can 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 eat it. Iya, kita mahu untuk kita 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 untuk Ile upah tu kena ada lagi dengan apa juga. Ile awal tu awak cut puni kunci mana boleh ingat? Ile pertama mana boleh je. Ile ni cerita tu mana mana tu, mana mana tu mana tu. So that is why after you take the food for at least minimum two to three hours, you should not consume anything else because the food will become half digested and half undigested. If you mix it or add some process, then that is why you have to eat the food for three hours. So that is why we have to eat the food for three hours. So at the end of the process of three hours, the food is converted into chyme. Chyme. So either way, either now the chyme and where is it found? Lo, see which one is better than all. There is that. Okay. Chyme. Then it enters the duodenum. This is a very important part because here the food rich in hydrochloric acid touches the duodenum, which means or near the which is mal and there is or waterfalls. At the patra, I have three. You can feel the patra, you know. 
start a body, it is called defecation reflex. Three reflex, micturition, please make a note of this, this is very important, micturition, parturition, defecation. Can you imagine, can you tell what are all these three? First is urination, second is, what is parturition? Passing stool. Okay, non-clear points. Pardon? Defecation. So, where are you? One of the other. Urine filled room. Motion filled room. So, here is some food for your thought. It is delivery of the fetus. Delivery of the fetus. Postpartum hemorrhage. Postpartum psychosis. Yes? So, partum means delivery. So, these are the three structures anterior to posterior. Anterior is the bladder. Next is the uterus, third is the <coughs> rectum or the tigmoid colon. All three work as a stretch mechanism. You imagine the child grows until 10 lunar months. Patthu amavasegalum, patthu pavonavigalum and the kolanda valarade. It is not 10 months, it, are, it is 10 lunar months, 280 days. Over amavasa or pavonami, one full moon, one no moon, totally 28 days. 10 28 days, 280 days. The total pregnancy period is 280 days and not 300 days. So it is 280 days. So the child grows, the fetus grows for 10 lunar months. At the end of the lunar months, what causes a trigger for the child, for the fetus to come out? Oxytocin, but by, by large, oxytocin, cholesterol, that is the total hormone level. The child becomes attains a certain level and it causes a stretch mechanism. It stretches the uterus. So when the uterus is stretched, the baby comes out. When the bladder is stretched, the urine comes out. When the rectum is stretched, the motion comes out. All three are following the same mechanism of stretch reflexes. Ida path rumbo achire patra. Restroom learning use pandra. Closet. Ulla or pandil. Tani rumbuchna the pande namo. Malapedo. Parathani and Nirpiro. In a bathroom the terrible sitting in a tani killer and you know. Thirumba tani rumbino. So the same stretch mechanism is inspired and that is what you daily use in your washrooms. Okay. So what are all the diseases that we are going to encounter here? So in the oral cavity, elderly or any adults, normal adults, they have a problem called aptus ulcer. Aptus ulcer or it is called stress ulcer. After ulcer or stress ulcer, why you say that? Elder in the time it was probably because of malnourishment, probably because of stress. Because by a particular, for a particular, army in the army, army in the army, 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 in Several times in the wife who is after the car of soda and biryani, you are not going to go to the car. That is why the synonymous meaning for after this ulcer is called stress ulcers. It heals by seven days, either you take ribofrepin or not. Either wife who is not going to go to the car, you are not going to go to the car, you are not going to go to the car, you are not going to go to the car. So the period of treatment for after this ulcer is. Seven days, it is self-healing, it doesn't require any treatment. Probably if you want to help your body, 
you should not feel with the slow tree you feel detector you should avoid that so what are the next problem that elderly encounter in the mouth sharp tooth sharp tooth white sharp tooth it's a process called attrition the process called attrition what is attrition teimanam attrition and na teimanam palla grind panni grind panni grind panni enna aagum and the palla teimana attrition kodunga ah yes attrition so here you can see attrition so attrition is nothing but usage of teeth and the teeth can become sharp and the sharp teeth can cause chronic rubbing of the cheek and it can end as squamous cell carcinoma fire cancer vandu nariye per kelvi kepanga avaru oru cigarette bidi cigarette adikka matta sir avaru drinks aapta matta go illa archana vela seiyaru irundhalum vaayu avaru cancer vaayu kadavu naamathu sonna vaayil poi eppadi cancer vandadhu theriyala appo sonna ungalukku idhuda explanation cancer varadhukku tobacco is a reason but apart from tobacco sharp tooth can also be a reason it can be as hazardous as a tobacco so what should how do you treat sharp tooth enna pannanum sharp ah irukadha teeche mudichu mukkiya aathi vidanum that is done by the dental surgeon but if the teeth is used properly grind it well you don't take too many risk you uh, chew slowly you eat you eat for a standard time at least then up to minutes you have to eat sir per moonay nenga kada 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 saapte sakka gali pannu vandu ipo ode avara rendu per thirumbi paathu ipo kali pannu ipo utkaadanga ipo saaptaanga enna pannaanga therilla kada kada saaptuvaanga mella saaptinga adhu romba vayasa saaptinga pallu theeve theeya blade theeve theeya so the sharp tooth can cause chronic rubbing of the cheek and that can get us some red patches or white patches and it is called leukoplakia or or not or again another condition called erythroplakia Leukoplakia and erythroplakia are pre-cancerous condition. It can come in tobacco chewing because elders can have lot of tobacco chewing habit for a very long time. For a very long time, they can have tobacco chewing problem, and they can end up into leukoplakia and erythroplakia. Leuko is white patches, erythro is red patches. So it is a pre-cancerous condition, and the patient can end up into submucosal fibrosis. Yes, I'm up. Go back, come on, turn left. Long time, I didn't chew for now. Attrition is a physiology. Attrition is not a pathology. Attrition, attrition is not a disease. Attrition is a Uh, is a physiology but uh, but attrition from the sharp tooth attrition and the sharp tooth varada thalikalam idha nama mella saaptinga na samama they gada 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 saaptinga enna avuna meedu pallama they pa shara kala pathina load edhina or overama tire thenjirum or overam tire thookittirukum appo enna pannuvanga tire reverse pannuvanga appo samama they tire la car vechirukumba thenjirukum unna pinna car tire maathanum solluvanga சமமா தேய்ணும்ங்கிறதுக்காக அந்த மாதிரி நிதானமா சாப்பிட்டீங்கன்னா பல்லு வந்து சமமா தேய் நீங்க கடால் 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 சாப்பிட்டு அப்படியே வாயிலே வச்சிட்டு அப்படியே திருப்பி பக்கம் வச்சு தொடச்சிட்டு கிளாஸ் வந்து உட்கார்ந்தீங்கன்னா என்ன ஆகும்னா ஷார்ட் டூப் வரும் ஷார்ட் டூப் வந்ததுன்னா லூகோ பிரேக்கியா எரிதுரோ பிரேக்கியா வரும் அது சம்யூகோ செல் பைமோசிஸாவும் மாறலாம் இல்ல வாயில ஸ்குவாமஸ் செல் காசினோமாவும் மாறலாம் சோ ஃபார் கேன்சர் இன் தி ஸ்போரல் கேவிட்டி யூ டோன்ட் रिक्वायर யூ டோன்ட் रिक्वायर tobacco necessarily even a sharp tooth can cause squamous cell carcinoma and just imagine and just note one point in your mind any cancer in the gastrointestinal tract is better there is no treatment 
Even if the patient is identified in the first stage, second stage, maximum the patient can be there for six months to one year. But cancer of uterus, testis, um, ovaries, uh, ovaries not necessary, especially the uterus and testis, uh, breast. These are treatable if identified early because they are present outside, outside the body, so easily treatable. Any cancer of gastrointestinal tract is fatal. Then the last entity what you will end up in elderly. So this image is nicotine stain. Nicotine stain. Because elders in Vaisanomone are a kaitala of Mumbai. Elarme Yogi Sarkamata. And you can have the opposite of Panga. Lupa Dosha smoking, Napa Dosha tobacco chewing. அறுவதுலாம் So, last problem in the mouth, what we will discuss is oral candidiasis. Or other ways it is called crush. Especially it comes in elderly who are bed bound or who are unexposed to sun. When you are born, 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 by the oral candidiasis varla. So, it, can, it, it is easily treatable. They can be given oral antifungals like clotrimazole, uh, uh, oral pain can be given. So, like this, white patches can be present. This white patches is not leukoplakia. How do you differentiate? In this white patches, you give clotrimazole, clotrimazole oral pain, this white patches will disappear. Whereas, the Short to causing leukoplakia, the white patches will not disappear. And I have failed to explain what is submucosal fibrosis. Chronic usage of tobacco can shrink the expandability of the cheek. If I used to call that, why did I tell you, if you have to take four fingers or take three, if you have to take three, how many fingers goes in? Three. Three. Pillarke, four in Pogala, pillarke, five in Pogala. But below two, below two, it is called submucosal fibrosis because the cheek becomes fibrose. Fibrosis means sclerose. Tight fibro, that is called therakam. It is generally seen in the in the Padatala Varalvich Karakam. So, it is called Malambatis classification. That is not very important. So, uh, and the number of fingers passing through your finger uh, through your mouth is very important. Minimum of three, four, five can go. Two and below is dangerous. And uh, generally it happens in this uh, tobacco oil Kaila, nicotine, sphere So elders are so elders are or golden problems. So next we we'll come with the problem of the ease of virus. Problem of the esophagus. Esophagus is a postman. Our palm, no, no digestion, carrier, no, no carrier. Our valve, all me, na, pannu, putta, mella. It tries to push the food in a slow fashion, in a slow fashion into the stomach. This is the place where peristalsis starts. Peristalsis. What is peristalsis? It's a like a palm belly the body. It's like a snake movement. The peristalsis movement is from oral to aboral end. Boil and then asana by no kina dale beso. But cutler kale in the cutler no kya is it? The waves always come to the shore. The waves hold the way all over the silver of the poor. Return tangina moment and the return tight swara. Ade mari the peristalsis wave. It is also called peristalsis wave comes from the oral to the aboral end. Why are this? So this here shows that the pupillary matter doesn't come through the stomach, uh, through the stomach and mouth. Akla liya, peristalsis liver sacha hai na ho. Why are you? Students are there. Why are you? Students 
stool zone of picolens vomiting, it can happen in a condition called reverse peristalsis. Sometimes the peristalsis can go in a reverse fashion. Of an ammo, picolens vomiting can happen very rare, very rare. Just you have to understand that. So, peristalsis is a wave which is managed by the vagus and it is an involuntary reaction. The peristalsis wave
when the when the cell is growing without any obstruction or without any control it is called cancer it is called neoplasia when a cell grows without any yaroda kattupad illama yaroda kattupad illama or cell grow avudhu appadina adu per adu per vandu neoplasia appdin porul epdi neovascularization is very dangerous in your eyes retinal neovascularization in the it's called progressive or oh, what retinopathy yes diabetic retinopathy so here also neoplasia neovascularization new vessels are very dangerous it causes neoplastic condition then leading to the use of agas now we will come to the stomach stomach you are activity now when the stomach the food is in a limited condition no problem excess food again here neoplasia can come it can end up into ca stomach the ca the ca stomach the very prominent areas are the pylorus pundus antrum why gastrointestinal malignancies are fatal any idea
is absent. Nobody else? Thank you.